we're looking at slide eight. So for slide eight is where you're gonna input your information about your exotic pet that you have chosen. If you have not chosen your pet yet, you're gonna need to do that first. And then you're gonna use your three subject notebook, the writing section to write down your information so that you won't have to kind of go back and forth between Google and your slide space. You can write your information down in your notebook and then you, when you get finished, you can go to your slides and just input it into the slides. So here's some things that you need to look for when you're looking um, up your information. So describe the habitat of your animal. Where does your animal live? What is the climate in the area of the world where your animal lives? What can be found in the animal's environment? Why does this animal thrive there? Thrive means to live very successfully. Why does it do well there? All right, that is for your habitat section. For the physical trait section, you're gonna describe the physical makeup of this animal. Yesterday, I let you guys describe me, physical characteristics, personality. So you're gonna do that same thing for your animal. What does your animal look like? How much does it weigh? How big does your animal get? How is the animal different in appearance? How is the male animal different in appearance than the female animal? Okay, think about your lion. We just read the story. We call him Cuddles. He was a lion. And it told you specifically the thing that separates the male lion from the female lion. What was it? What does a male lion have that a female lion doesn't have? Big mane of fur around its head and its chest. The female lion doesn't have that. She just sort of has slick hair like a cat. So you may look at that information. Your animal, if it's a male, might look differently than if it's a female, okay? So that is your physical traits and then the behavior of your animal. Describe the animal's typical behavior. What does the animal eat? How does this animal interact with other animals? Is it a loner? You know, the lion, he's sort of the king of the jungle. He likes to hang out by himself, right? The female lions hang out together, but the male, they, they fight off other males that come around. So. How does your animal interact with other animals? When is the animal most active? Some of your animals might be nocturnal. Um, what does the animal spend most of its time doing? What about the lion? Let's just use it for an example again. They're hunters, right? When do they hunt mostly? At night. At night. And just like a normal house cat, what do you see a normal house cat doing most all day long? Sleeping. Lions sleep in the day, they hunt at night. So when does your animal get the most active? And so I think the easiest way to do would be to go to Chrome and Google information. You know, if you hit the image tab, it'll show you pictures. If you hit all, it'll show you information about it. Write down the answers to these questions in your notebook, and then you can just have your notebook right beside you as you type directly into your slides. Remember, you can just go straight into the Google Slides app. You don't have to go through the Schoology link from Monday. It's already all saved in your, in your slides app. So I hope this was helpful. Watch more videos, subscribe to our channel.